Hi guys, welcome to Mademoiselle Tarot. Today I've decided to do a reading on the silent survivor. Now we've heard a lot about everyone in this Idaho Fall case, but we haven't heard anything about Bethany. Bethany Funky. I will name her BF. Now keep in mind that this is a tarot reading. So it's all speculation. But I would like to find out what her energies were before, during and after. The incident. All we know is that she was asleep and she knows nothing about it. So I'd like to see what comes up in the cards about BF. The Silent Survivor. I've asked the Angel Guides and Spirit to join me in this read. Protect me, please, with God's white protective light. Only my angels, guides and spirit to join this read and give me clear messages. For BF, the silent survivor of the Idaho murders, please. Could I please have clear messages? Let's see what comes out here. Nine cards, please. This is my favourite spread, guys. Sorry. I do love this spread. It seems to bring out a, a lot of truth for me. So first up, we have the Two of Cups and the Six of Swords. So we'll do before, before the incident, please. During the incident, and after. Sorry guys, I will place these the other way. Before, during and after the murders, please spirit. Bethany Funky, the Idaho Four. 
the silent survivor. We have the Two of Cups, the Six of Swords, the Three of Swords, the Eight of Wands, the Six of Pentacles, the Page of Pentacles, The Knight of Cups, we have one more card please Spirit, one more card. The Lovers and the Eight of Cups. She did have a beautiful connection with these girls. She may have had some sort of disagreement with one of them, but they decided to agree to disagree. There was some sort of communication that come in and there was some quick action. She did find out some news before the incident and she was trying to be practical about the situation. During the murders, she wanted to get out of there. She really was feeling down about the situation. She didn't want to have anything to do with it. She really was hoping and wishing that something wasn't happening that she knew was happening. She was praying. There was, was an emotional force here. She was feeling sensitive, over-emotional, very temperamental. She did go into her room and wanted to be on her own, become very introverted.
She was heartbroken. She knew that there was a betrayal after the incident. And she does have an awareness now of what happened. But there is a deeper meaning. Because she actually walked away from the choices she should have made at the time. Why is this Two of Cups here, please, Spirit? Why is this Two of Cups here? The connection she had with the girls, please. Why is this Two of Cups here? The Tower. There was a sudden change in the situation, in their relationship and in the connection before this occurred. What was the communication about, please, Spirit? What was the communication about? Thank you. The Six of Cups. The communication was about something in the past. Something that happened in the past. It's, she is innocent. Why is the page of pentacles here, please, spirit? Why is the page of pentacles here? She was a trustworthy friend. Whatever's happened here has really hurt her. She was a trustworthy friend. Thank you. This communication that happened and what she was aware of was really giving her nightmares. It was keeping her up at night. Why is the Six of Swords here? She did want to get out of there. Thank you. She really was struggling with her thoughts at the time. She knew abuse was going on. She knew that there was an open dishonour happening 
and she knew that she was being dishonest by not calling the police. But she needed to look after herself here. Why is the star here, please, Spirit? Thank you. The Three of Cups, friendship. Community. She was afraid of all the other people that knew what was going on. She was praying for her friends here. She didn't know the extent of what was going to happen. So she went into her room and just prayed and prayed and prayed for her friends. But it was really, she was really struggling with her thoughts. Could we, why is the Knight of Cups here, please? She was totally over emotional, the star again. She was really praying for these girls. She was really praying during what had happened. Conflict in her own mind on what to do. But she just knew that she had to stay out of it. Totally heartbroken, the Three of Swords, thank you. When she, Ace of Swords, when she found out the truth, when she had clarity on what had happened, she was absolutely devastated. She really does want justice for this girl, but there's a mental force here that's stopping her from telling the truth. Knowledge is power. Could we clarify the Six of Pentacles, please? She knows that knowledge is power. So she pretended that she didn't know anything. She didn't hear anything. She didn't see anything. Could we clarify the Six of Pentacles, please, Spirit? Let's clarify the Six of Pentacles. Knowledge is power. Thank you. She's reassuring herself at the moment that everything's going to be okay. She's feeling a bit scared on how much she does know. 
because she doesn't want the same thing to happen to her. She just keeps re reassuring herself, it's okay, it's okay, everything's going to be okay. She's scared because she knows that knowledge is power and people know that she knows. She walked away, or she's walked away from her own beliefs. From her own personal beliefs and values. And the relationship that she had with her friends. And the deeper meaning to this is because she was scared. Why are the Eight of Cups and the Lovers here, please, Spirit? Frightened of what she does know. She's not willing to take the risk. of telling what she knows. It was an unexpected change for her friends and she was just praying for them in her room. Not prepared to take the risk. It's all going over and over in her head, what's happened and how she's staying out of it. Totally over emotional. She must have been crying in her room. But her knowing what has happened is scaring her. And she just keeps reassuring herself that she'll be okay as long as she doesn't say anything. And at this time, she's not willing to take the risk. But she did have communication about something from the past. She knows that this has something to do with something that's happened beforehand. She was so worried. It really was keeping her up at night. She was worried that something serious was going to happen. And she was praying for her friends. But yes, when she found out what had happened afterwards, she was devastated. And now she's scared. But she knows a lot more than what she's letting on because she's too scared to say a word. She's not prepared to take the risk. I shall leave the reading there. If you liked, please like, share and subscribe. Love and light.